Hello, everyone. I'm Xu, a student from University of Colorado Boulder. In this video, I'm going to present our work about chatbot debugging, co-authored with Michelle, Matt, and Tom. This work is about how to design better interview chatbots. To answer this question, we first hope to understand what are interview chatbots. Traditionally, interviews or surveys were pencil-paper based or via face-to-face -face conversations. With the rise of AI techniques, chatbots have been proposed to conduct conversational interviews. Here's a good example of how such an interview chatbot works. Interactive features such as handling user inputs enables this chatbot to be effective in engaging interviewees. Despite interview chatbot promises, interview chatbot designers face challenges in an interactive design process. For example, this figure shows an unrecognized user input during an interview, which could result in poor user experience or even abandoned interviews. To detect such issues in practice, chatbot designers must examine tons of chat transcripts to discover them. It is laborious and time-consuming to do so manually, especially if the designers don't have much relevant experience. To address the challenges, we have been developing a tool called iChat Profile, which can aid chatbot designers in building, evaluating, and improving interview chatbots interactively. In order to develop a chat profile, we took a three-step method, formative study, system development, and evaluation. This system was developed under the guidance of a formative study, where we identified two types of design assistance desired by chatbot designers. The first type is objective quantitative feedback on their existing chatbot design. Almost all participants express the need for receiving such feedback on their chatbot. For example, one participant mentioned that I hope to receive some feedback telling me the exact score my chatbot will get. The second type is actionable design suggestions for improving the existing chatbot. Almost all participants express that they still wouldn't know what to do even if a quantitative evaluation was available. To reflect the first cap, we formulated a set of performance metrics as a framework to quantitatively assess the effectiveness of an interview chatbot from three main dimensions, elicitation ability, user experience, and ethics. For example, informativeness is used to evaluate how informative the user input is. The higher, the better. With the help of the framework as well as the formative study results, we developed a chat profile. It consists of three key components, chatbot profile generator, design suggestion generator, and profile presenter. Profile presenter here assembles profile and design suggestions together and displays in a visual dashboard for easy comprehension. This is an example of the chatbot profile dashboard. It provides multi-phased feedback based on quantified chatbot performance evaluation. Here's another example. With the help of natural language generation techniques and clustering algorithms, iChat Profile provides actionable design suggestions and evidential conversation fragments for designers' reference. To evaluate the effectiveness of iChat Profile, we designed and conducted a between-subject user study. We first built a baseline interview chatbot without making any design customizations and then built an iChat profile dashboard based on the collected transcripts. Then, 10 participants were randomly assigned to two groups, and they were asked to design a chatbot on top of the baseline, with or without iChat profile. The ACOVA results showed that iChat profile helped designers build better interview chatbots. For example, chatbots designed with iChat profile received better scores at both engaging users and enlisting higher quality inputs. The ACOVA analysis showed that such improvements are significant. On the other hand, we observed iChat Profile help designers make design decisions. iChat Profile is able to get designers to make practical chatbot improvements. For example, one participant rewarded the baseline question to make it more acceptable. We also observed iChat Profile even inspired designers to make creative changes more than what it originally suggested. Such observations help explain why a chat profile can help build better chatbots. If you are interested, please refer to our paper for more details. Thank you for listening.